It's a big world out there for these tiny sea turtles as they make their way to the ocean. They swim out to sea where they'll spend the first year of their life drifting in a seaweed raft. But now University of Florida zoologist Archie Carr, who has made tracking the reptiles as life's work, says this sea turtle nursery is not as safe as it used to be. They eat things they shouldn't. They eat tar balls. They're especially addicted to uh, grabbing hold of a little pellet of tar. And they either swallow it and it uh, chokes them, or it gums their jaws together and they can't eat anything else. Dr. Carr's numerous books and articles, which have stirred worldwide interest in saving the sea turtle, have just won him the Audubon Society's highest award for nature writing. If you're going to dedicate most of your working life to understanding a creature that has been you know, on the verge, in some cases, of extinction, you're going to go to bat for it at every, every opportunity. The University of Florida researcher and his students will continue to study sea turtles, hoping to learn more about their behavior and how they can be saved. In Gainesville, I'm Chris Dudley.